A scientific breakthrough in reading the mind of your dog, raising the possibility we've only begun to communicate as much as we could. Here's ABC's Steve Hosanzami. We've all seen those incredibly smart dogs that are too cool for school and can dance their way to a million dollar prize. Find Inky. Or find a needle in a haystack. <laughs> or even save your life if you're drowning. Oh, I know. Researcher Greg Burns had an idea no one's ever tried, okay. to teach his dog Callie to sit perfectly still for a series go. of MRIs and actually look into her brain. Getting her still was the hard part. They practiced with this contraption at home for months. And now these are the first images of an active dog's brain. During the test, they showed Callie hand signals she'd already learned. We essentially gave a hand signal like this, which means you're about to get a hot dog soon, or this hand signal, which means no hot dog. This was after the signal for no hot dog. Her brain was quiet, but it lit up when she saw the signal for the treat in an area of the brain that processes feelings of reward. For the first time, researchers say this is scientific proof dogs are capable of more complex communication, and not just with a few signals, but potentially an entire sign language. It proves that they've transferred the meaning of these hand signals to something that's behaviorally important to them. It's really getting at the start of how the dog processes dog-human communication. Take a look again at this amazing million-dollar performance and look closely for the hand signals. Hands outstretched, fingers touched, and palms up. An intricate conversation. I've always wondered what my dogs are thinking when I call them and they come. Do they recognize my voice? And do they love me as much as I think they do? Burns says the answer is yes. His newest brain scan shows Callie has the capacity for love and certainly loves him, but loves his wife even more. Steve Osinsami, ABC News, Atlanta.